This is Abel's Global Prayers once again on your way. This channel is meant for contending earnestly for the heavenly kingdom of God. If this is your first time, please click on the bell notification icon. Give us a subscription to receive from us daily inspired, contagious messages capable of blessing and touching your life and your soul and your spirit. Now, today we are talking about the biblical meanings of snakes in your dreams. Biblical meanings of snakes, snakes in dreams. Now, if you happen to have dreamt of seeing snakes in your dream, then this could be the possible interpretations of the mind of God over your dreams. Now, the word dream appears in the Bible 74 times. Dreams are ways and method and procedures which God uses to communicate to humanity. Now, God uses dreams to communicate to humanity. The word humanity simply here, what I'm trying to imply here is that God uses dream to speak to born again Christians and uses dream to speak to unbelievers or those who do not believe in God. Now, in the book of Exodus, we find out that Pharaoh, who wasn't submitted to God or who didn't even have, have an idea of who the God of the Israel is, um, had a dream and in his dream he couldn't interpret it or he didn't understand or he was lacking the understanding of the dream which he had. Now, dreams is something good and if you find a snake or you see a snake in your dreams, these are what it means. Now, in Genesis chapter 3 and the verse number 1, um, the Bible says that, and the serpent was more subtle than all the animals on the field. Now, the word subtle here means that clever, wiser, or it had wisdom more than any other animal. Now, the word subtle was placed in a, uh, in a positive form. Now, when you study the Bible, you will see that in creation, Anytime God created something, the Bible tells us that God took his time, did some examination over all that he has created, and he concluded that it was good and it was nice, including the serpent. Now, these are the characters of the serpent or a snake in a, according to the biblical form. So when you see a snake in your dreams, these are the characters according to the Bible. When you see a snake according to the Bible, it means that sometimes it's wisdom, sometimes it represents knowledge, sometimes it represents hope, sometimes it represents healing, sometimes it represents um, faith, and sometimes also it represents deceptions, lies, and also addictives. Now, all these are characters of snake in a biblical form. Now, if you happen to see a snake in your dream, it could be that God is trying to make you wiser by Genesis chapter 3, verse number 1. And again, in the book of Numbers chapter 21 and the verse 6, 7, 8, the Bible says that the people of God, which were the Israelites, when they were following Moses to the promised land, the Bible said they sinned against God and God sent snakes on the land of which they were living and they were bitten by these snakes and most of them were dying. So they, they, they remembered that they had sinned against God. They went to Moses and spoke with Moses to pray to God to take away the snakes in the midst of them. The Bible said that the Lord spoke to Moses and said to Moses that make a snake in a form of bronze and hang it upon a pole and tell or command them to look upon the pole as they watch the snake they shall be healed and they will be recovered and the bible said that those that looked upon the pole and saw the bronze of snake which moses had made upon the pole the bible said they were healed so if you dream and you see a snake in your dream it could be that God is bringing healing in your way. I cannot tell whether you are sick or not, but that is what the Bible is saying. And this is um, um, biblical interpretations of snake. So uh, it could be that God is now communicating healing to you. If you are a sick person and God wants to speak, 
And again, in the book of Matthew chapter 10 and the verse 16, the Bible says that now Jesus was sending his disciples out and he says, he says to them, I am sending you out as a sheep among or in the midst of the wolves but i want you to be wise as the serpent so we know that in here jesus says that the serpent is the wisest animal on the earth so when you see snake in your dreams in the biblical interpretation it could be that god is taking you to a level of wisdom or a level of intelligence or knowledge which you never had before and again in the book of genesis chapter 3 and the verse number one we see the act of the serpent as deceiving if to go against the rules of God or deceiving her to go against the order and the command of God. So sometimes when you see a snake in your dream, God is communicating to you that there is a spirit of deception which is being placed upon you or you are finding yourself in a midst or a way which is at the end of it, you shall be deceived. When you read the book of Revelation chapter, chapter 12 and the verse number seven the bible says that a war broke out of heaven and michael and and his angel were fighting the dragon and his angel and it came to pass that the dragon and its angel couldn't defeat the the they couldn't defeat michael and his angel and therefore there was no place found for them anymore in heaven and they were thrown or they were empowered and they were thrown out of heaven and now the bible continues to say that the old serpent the devil or satan so in other words a snake can be a satan in a dream that has disguised or a, a, the spirit of the devil which has disguised itself as a snake to to deceive to lie or to seduce you to do something against the will of God or contrary to the will of God. So, so in a biblical meaning, these are the things snake can mean. That is when you see a snake in your dream, what it means. Now, I want to tell you that when it comes to dream and its meaning, God alone can give you more understanding of it. But by the grace of God, we are giving out the little we know and I trust God that it will be a blessing to you. This is Abel's Global Prayers and I feel very excited and overjoyed to have come your way. Um, if this is your first time you are watching me, please click on the bell notification icon. Thank you for watching me. Give me a subscription and again, stay very blessed and anointed and always stand so strong, unbeaten and un un undefeated until by the grace of God, I shall come on your way once again. Shalom. Peace.